Okay, so we're back here now. So I got the stopwatch, so uh, opens the door over here. Oops. So now we can get the Alucard stuff. Also, heart upgrades. So yeah, there's the Alucard mail. Well, use only if you want to grind for drops. There's only one drop I'm really want to grind for. Well, shit. Now we gotta wait for a minute. Because that won't open until like a minute. So, uh, yep. Gotta wait. <laughs> so, okay. So while we're waiting, I want to talk about Castlevania Portrait of the Moon. I mean, Portrait of Ruin. I never played that game before, and I wanted to, I was like, oh, I, I, I like, I, I'll just play it on an emulator and see, that, like, see if I can play it. Yeah, um, PS, uh, DS emulators are weird, and there's probably some setup and stuff, and probably my, and also my PC can't really run it, because it, it's, it's a low, low-end PC by today's standards. Oh, good fucking lords open. But, um, <laughs> they have specific, like, the characters, um, Jonathan and Charlotte, they have these specific animations to be just hold up. And they do these funky poses, like, like, fucking, Jonathan's pose is fucking silly. He fucking, like, wiggles his fucking hips and shit. It's hilarious. Like, give him those stylized pose. Mm, yeah. Oh, hey. Hey, Edgelord. Bitch, Skellerang. Bitch, Skellerang. You ain't getting me anything. Bitch. Now we're gonna, I think we're gonna fight Pacific and the Knights that were in um, Bloodlines. Like there was a sword guy, a sword knight, and a hammer knight. Oh yeah, there's this guy too. We're not gonna worry about him. Cheese. Okay, and a broadsword. Still ain't gonna use that. We got, we got, we got, wait, is the broadsword better? Cause some, so, well, I don't think it should be better because um, we ain't supposed to be able to get this because we get the mist power up in the Calcium. So we shouldn't be able to use this until we have went to the Calcium. So no, I'm pretty sure a lot of stuff we're gonna get so far is something I can't even, well, I can, but don't want to use. Yeah, I I'm just not even gonna deal with that enemy. Too many things to hit. Anything over here? No? Okay. I don't need a stopwatch anymore, so I'm waiting for a sub button to come in. Switch this out. Now we can. Now. We can fight these guys legit if we want to, but, uh. Level up! Yeah! Ah, bitch! Fucking kick me! So yeah, that doesn't hurt you. It's just a cool, like I'm dead animation. They just put it in just to be cool, cause it's cool looking. Put in things that are just to be cool. Castlevania Symphony of the Night. No actual function except for being cool. What's over here? Yeah, what's this? What the hell is over here? Oh, this is a quick travel room, right? Yep, quick travel room. All right. We don't need that right now, we're going to the Calcium. So, that guy took some chunk of my house, so I'm gonna give him the Soul Steel. Because his brother isn't that tough, he's just this guy. Bitch! Don't fucking kick me, you asshole! Fuck you! Yeah, die. I want your sword though, but I can't grab it. Also, I love how they handled the voicing in this game. They had this weird little weird like weird weird filtering on their um voices that makes everything sound so fucking cool. 
Oh, speaking of voices, remember the elevator we used? I forgot to do it in reverse, because um, I love how, because if you go down reverse, Alucard starts falling, and, like, it starts dropping down, and Alucard actually reacts. He's like, Rah! like, he's, like, I, there's so much detail in this game. Attention to detail. So, uh, so, uh, we're about to hear, like, one of the best songs in this fucking game. It starts out silent at first, but just listen. Yeah, Castlevania music. Oh, it's these guys from Castlevania: Rondo of Blood. I think this is the guys. The guys are no, no, they might be higher up. See over there? See, this is the mist power up. We'll get the mist after we're done with this area. Oh, there was a save point to the die pass, but whatever. I can just get some health this way. That's good enough, right? Unfortunately, these guys don't have their bitch screens anymore. Unfortunately. Bitch. Forever up. There's a... There's a secret ceiling around here. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Do I? I don't think I got a weapon that can hit uh, the ceiling at the moment. I'm. I might. Let me see if I. Let me try like specific weapons. What does the Alucard sword do anything? Like if you press R one and it no. Alucard. Uh, let's try some weapons. Does this any do anything different? Can I aim upwards with this? Okay, don't aim upwards with this. Like I need a Pacific. Oh, oh man, if I had the axe, the axe weapon, I probably could break the hole on the top, but I don't have that. I don't think I have anything that can do something like this at the moment, so I'm just going to put my fist back on. Uh, Alright. Wasted so many fucking hearts, doing absolutely nothing. Woo! So over here, as we're plot and we fight a boss, we're not going to fight the boss yet until we get... A bunch of stuff because we're supposed to get we're gonna get one of the coolest items in the game very oh what did i just grab oh this is oh this is this weird taser gun weapon hold up let me just grab this and what's over here oh look at that we're back here metroidvania <laughs> everything leads back to a place But, um, save points over here? I think a game is re really well designed if I actually remember where almost every single area is like on the game. Because I only played through this game like twice and that's it. I didn't... I, okay, so this is a Pacific Road. I probably need to do a Soul Steel for there's more. There's more. But oh, pff, woo, woo, woo. what? Oh God! Oh, as the guns guys are shooting me. Oh, oh, oh well. Oh, 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 oh. I see my health bar. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Uh, we're, we're going back. We're going back. We're going back. Oof. Oof. They're protecting that room for a good fucking reason. They're they're protecting that room for a good reason. And we're, we're, I'm gonna show you what is in this room. Take this. Take that. Also, if you want to do the big fireball version of that move, you gotta hold up. Cause if you just do, if you just do up and then quarter circle normally, it'll just do the fireballs like Dracula. Like, eh. You have to hold up by when he disappears to get the the meteors. Okay, so we got the shield rod. This is actually one of the coolest weapons in the game. Now, as you can see, it's it's slightly better than the fists, so we're gonna use it. But okay. 
So, but that's not so. This is one of the weapons you want to use forever. This is weapons you. Be, this is a weapon you can keep coming back to. And you want to know why? Because it's called the shield rod. You see, I have a sh shield. Okay, so I I can't. I got my shield, but I can't use it for some reason. Is that? Oh wait, sh <laughs> I forgot. I put shield on um L1 instead of triangle. So see, I have shield, but if I press the attack button and the button and the shield button at the same time. Power of cow. So, depending, but defense up. Depending on what shield you have, um, the shield rod can do something specific with it. So, the leather shield probably uses the power of its ancestors, aka the cow that was probably used to make the leather of the shield. Um, Alucard shield doesn't do anything with it, but um, if we use the knight shield. The Night Shield, I think if I know this, what this does, is fucking rad. Let's, we're gonna do this on a bunch of enemies, hold up. Also, um, before we kill a bunch of enemies... Yeah, look at this enemy. L let me kill his fucking owl and watch this shit, like... I feel bad now. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. You're, I killed your best friend. I am so sorry. That is the saddest enemy in a video game I've ever seen. He, If you kill his pet, he mourns from it and stops fighting for a while. It's insane. Like, the fucking attention to Oh, 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 this enemy. Oh, this is actually a good time to try this move out. Oh! Oh, okay, this isn't the right shield. So, the shield I was thinking of is the iron shield. Uh, we don't have yet. We could probably buy it at the shop. Like, like, same thing happens if we kill the guy. Look. No, my master! <laughs> oh, sad face. Oh. Uh, hello. Oh, uh, this guy's from Rondo. This guy is fucking nuts, he knows the kung fu and shit. But, uh, Shield Rod is technically stronger than what I have, but, uh, we're gonna stick to the Jewel Knuckles because it's faster. Green Tea, this was supposed to be an alcoholic drink in the Japanese version, but, you know, we can't have alcohol in our video games, I guess. It's so sad. Fuck off. Oh, okay, so we're probably gonna do a soul steal. Oh! Oh, can't- wait, can't- uh... Oh, wait. Do I gotta... Okay, that's- Yeah, you hang on to the um the item I mean, the item weapon when you're doing that. That's actually a pretty cool sub weapon. But you probably need a lot of hearts to use it though. That's over here. Oh, save. Alright. We need to get our asses around and get back to the top so we can get um that weapon. I mean go go fight the boss of this area and then wait did we hit the we did did we go down? Yeah we went wait, is there any more down down? Okay, what's over here? Oh, uh hi guys. Thanks. Oh, yeah. Holy water. Holy water doesn't use as much fucking, um... That weapon is cool, but, um... It uses a lot of hearts. The holy water is the best weapon in the game, so... You should probably use that instead. Whoa! Look at this! You see, you remember this enemy from Rondo of Blood? It's dead. <laughs> oh, shit, skeleton. Uh, yeah. Oh! Oh, I got hit by his big boner. 
Hellfire. Now, okay, so let's talk about this enemy for a second. This enemy drops one of the best gears in the game after you beat the game. So if you beat the game and then um and you have a completed save file on your file list, if you fight this enemy and grind for him, he gives you like the best gear in the game. Hey. Give me your sword. Give me it. No, I don't want money, I want your goddamn sword. Whoa. Blood crook. Blood coat converts damage to hearts. Um, sh luck goes down. Defense goes up. Constitution goes up. Uh, but my luck goes down. I'm not grinding for stuff yet, so whatever. Also, look at my cape. Red cape out of card. Because, you know, capes change the way you look. Oh, and also, let's go for... Let, let's look at this for a second. This is fine. But we can't have alcohol in this game. Logic. Ow. Fuck. Nope. I'm, I'm trying to do Hellfire, if you guys don't know what I'm trying to do. You know what? Fuck it, I'm just gonna fucking punch her. Whatever. Hellfire, take this! Oh, I think his boner's in the way. It's hard for me to hit him. Oh god. Oh, I, I was desperately trying to do soul steal and it didn't come out. I was like, oh, I, I do. I was like, I do need some health back, but I could guess I could just head to the save point, which is right up here. I think my favorite cape in the game is the one that's kind of that's invisible. I think it's the best cape in the in the PS1 version because I think there's a better cape in the 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 Saturn version where it's white. That's better, but um. The clear cape I remember was my favorite. But now we need to head back so we can get the fight the boss, get the mist, and leave this area because I've done everything except for the one hidden room up here that I apparently can't get yet because I need a certain. I need it. Actually, I need an axe. That's what I need to get it. But I don't think there's any axes around here. So I might have to come back to this later to get whatever the hell is in this room. So I'm gonna head to the save point, save, and then we're gonna fight the boss. I know I'm pretty sure I can probably easily defeat the boss, but safe than sorry, I guess. I'm, I'm always so cautious. It's good to be cautious. Because there's only really one really hard boss in this game, and that's like at the end of the game. It's an optional boss. Alright. Oh, wait. I, you know, sometimes I forget I can do this. Oh, I got a library card. <laughs> Who that? Who are you? Open Hell's Gate. Come forth, my servants. Richter. The scent of your blood. You're a Belmont. Crush this flea who invades my castle. <laughs> and look, enemies from Rondo of Blood. Give me your souls. You know, this guy was only fucking tough in the Dracula X game. I played that too, and I beat that too, and fuck that game. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm gonna do it cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna kill him cool, cool like guys. Or, or not. Whoops. Wait, did he still get naked? 
I'm certain that was a Belmont. So he says he's the lord of this castle. But that was Richter. Richter Belmont from Rongo Blood. What happened to him? Why is he now evil? <gasps> no. Fuck. Now I got. Oh no! I gotta go around. Oh. Okay. 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 For a second. Fuck, man. Don't do that. That was not nice. Why would they do this? Would you please go back up, please? Why won't they have it make sure it connects so you so shit like that won't fucking happen? Okay. Now we can turn into farts. Oh wait. Oh, that's not that's also not it. What is it? Oh, circle is missed for me. Okay. Take this. You know how much I do that? It's not even that strong anymore. So what are we going to do with Richter now? He's now evil. We must see Maria for answers. But unfortunately, we're not going to see Maria until a good while cuz we need cuz um the next time we speak to Maria is in that spike room I was talking about. So we need to go into the basement and stuff. But we have a library card. We just got that from this place. So they wanted you to use this. So we can head back to the library. Because there's some areas we can now get to in the library we couldn't get to before. So before we're, do um, before, uh, we're done with recording, we're going to head to the library.